Good evening, Dr. Ezrani, board trustees, cabinet, and audience. It has been a busy beginning to the school year, and I am excited to share with you this evening. There are so many positive things happening at both Loma Rica and Foothill schools. Staff members at both sites are dedicated to making a difference for our students and making our schools examples for best practices, high expectations, and big gains for all. It takes a unified team to make it happen, and our teams are all in. Our single plan for student achievement ensures we have a guide for progress and success. We measure achievement with data and monitor student outcomes. This way we know we are putting funds where they are most needed and most impactful. This presentation will provide some examples of our shared vision and focus in greater detail. You have more slides in your handouts than what I will cover here, but I will be happy to elaborate or answer any questions you may have. Using a variety of methods, our stakeholders identified areas to dedicate our resources. My favorite thing about the school is the monkey bars, like the one that is straight and the ones that go up, back, up, back, and I'm really good at them. Reviewing data to make decisions about teaching and learning is an ongoing process and important in deciding where to put our funding. We drill down to target the right students with the right interventions. We are working hard to target and support our at-risk students and help them maintain positive connections to school. Our site plan consists of five goals that are aligned with the district LCAP goals. The majority of our budget has been dedicated to site goals one, two, and five. Our Title I and targeted budget is funding paraeducators in the combo classes at Loma Rica. Goal two strategies center around interventions, inclusion, and student supports. PBIS and positive school culture is key to our happy, healthy learners. Bringing our families back to campus and connecting with stakeholders is a top priority. I have included copies of our school newsletters in your handout so you can read about the ways we are making connections. In addition to the funding managed through our site plan, we also receive lottery and LCAP funding. This year, we also have some extra funding for after school interventions. PBIS expectations, routines, and systems are making it easier to focus on teaching and learning. Things that were difficult last year are much smoother this year because of the teamwork and dedication of staff, students, and our school community. This is a page of our new PBIS matrix that acts as a blueprint for student expectations. Our school spirit is evident in Ms. Swale's first and second grade classroom. We exchange a spirit flag each week for the winners to hang outside their door. And if you visit our school on a Friday morning, you will see a celebration of student achievements. The positive culture, awards, recognitions, and school spirit are a great representation of life at Loma Rica Elementary School. Foothill Intermediate School prides itself in maintaining a safe and supportive environment where young people grow and thrive. Students are recognized and celebrated for their accomplishments, and we want all students to be connected and a part of something that gives them confidence and success. Middle school students with a better foundation in reading were able to better maintain ELA test scores, but math scores show a bigger deficit. We are pulling out all the stops to get students back on track. Academic achievement, culture and climate, and parent involvement goals were the top priorities as we returned to school this year. In addition to the funding managed through our SIPSA, we also receive lottery and LCAP funding for music and athletics. This year, Foothill has a beginning and an intermediate band, and we hope to continue to grow this program. The student support specialist position was site council approved at the end of last school year, and that addition has been very helpful for the implementation of tier one supports and services. We are crew. 
The idea of crew relates to the ship we often use in conjunction with our Raider mascot. We work together and it takes a team to keep our ship moving in the right direction. We honor each student as an individual and strive to help them reach their potential, both academically and emotionally. Our discipline data shows a 40% decrease in incidents from this same time last school year. Parent involvement can tend to decrease as students get older. We strive to maintain a strong connection with our families, bringing them to campus whenever possible. Our PBIS systems work hand in hand with other programs to support students and help them love where they learn. We have two main goals for STEAM implementation this year. We are working closely with other schools and district support staff to achieve them. Teachers dedicate time for training and collaboration with colleagues to plan and build lessons and projects. Students and teachers are engaging in work that is challenging, adventurous, and meaningful inside and outside the classroom. Ag science was the focus for third grade students at Yuba Sutter Farm Day. Um, I liked when we saw all the salmon in the little cliff area, and I also liked when we went over the rapids. Our sixth graders attended Shady Creek Environmental Science Camp at the end of September. Our fourth and fifth grade students are learning to code and are working on a project they will present to peers. The fourth grade students are also training to teach fourth graders at another school how to code. This coaching project will help bring coding into another Foothill classroom while giving more purpose and to the hard work of some very dedicated students. So basically with, with the coding, we connect our robots hub to the computer. Then we, with the code that we have on the computer, we download that code into the hub so that when we press the button, it'll run that code. So like right now it would go like that, dump something, get the bonus and then navigate the rest of the way. All right, go ahead, Ryan. <laughs> All right, that's the farthest that's the one has made it so far. Good job. <laughs> Thank you for allowing me to share with you and for your ongoing support. In addition to the allocations we receive annually, the district is very supportive of our small schools, making sure our needs are met. And the biggest thank you goes to our teachers and staff who work so incredibly hard and make the real magic happen every day in our schools. Thank you.